Here we have an example that says write the equation of the line containing the two points or the given points. So if you'll remember we need two things in order to write an equation of a line. We need a point and we need the slope. Well in this case they actually gave us two points, right? So um, we need to find the slope because they didn't give that to us. So what I'm going to do first is I'm going to label these as x1, y1 and as x2, y2. And that way I can find my slope using the slope formula. The slope formula was y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1. So y2 is 5 minus y1 is negative 3 over x2 is negative 1 minus x1 is negative 1. Okay, these double negatives here become positives. So now we have 5 plus 3 is 8. Oops, didn't mean to do that in, yellow, in red there. A 5 plus 3 would be 8, and negative 1 plus 1 would be 0. Now, what happens when we have a 0 in a denominator? That is an undefined slope. And undefined is one of those special cases. If you'll remember, only one particular kind of line has an undefined slope. And that is always those vertical lines. Now all vertical lines come in the form of x equals some number. And in this case, x would be negative 1. Now let's just double check that just to make sure that we're correct. If we were to draw this out, the point negative 1, negative 3 would be negative 1 down 3, so that would put me right about there. And the point negative 1, 5 would be negative 1 and up 5, so that would put us right about here. Now the line between them is a vertical line, so that is exactly what we thought it should be.